the lid was on. Thought it was over. You guys know makeup is not cheap. <laughs> mm. Okay, we're back. Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Viennese. Today we're just going to do a really fun makeup look for fall. And if you are interested in how I got this look, you're going to want to stay tuned. Let's just get into the video. I'm going to take this concealer right here. My e.l.f. concealer. This is the Deep Cinnamon. And I'm just going to put that over my lids to prime them. Taking my beauty blender, I'm just going to dab my eyelids lightly, like so. And today we're going to be using the Saharian by Juvia's. And these are the colors that are inside. Aren't these so pretty for fall? So the first color I'm going to go into is this one right here and it's called Casina. And I'm just going to put that over my lids. And then guys, I want to go into this pretty orange color, this one right here. And that one's Jamila. I feel like that's screaming fall. Don't you think? I'm going to take some of that and I'm just going to put it in my crease. Is fall your favorite season? Fall is my favorite season. And I used to say it was summer, but as I've gotten older, and I don't know what it is. I think it's just the feel of the air, the happiness that's around the season. And I love Christmas, I love Thanksgiving. The leaves are changing, the weather's perfect. It's my favorite season to wear hoodies and the boots and all that stuff. It's just my kind of weather. You just feel joy, you know? All right, guys, then I'm gonna go into this color right here. It's like a deeper orange, almost like a reddish orange, it's called Sakato or Sokoto. I don't know if I'm pronouncing these words right, but I'm trying my best. And we're just going to sweep that over top of our crease just to put a little depth. See how that's just a little bit brighter. I'm also going to like bring that in a little bit. Going in the shape of a U, just around my lid. Oh, that's pretty. And then I'm going to go into Boraro. That's just pretty shimmer color right here, this orangey shimmer. And I'm just applying that to the center of my lid, the inner corner, just bringing it out. Dabbing it in the center and the inner corner. How do you think it looks? I like it a lot. Are you a dramatic color eyeshadow girl or are you a more neutral? I'm normally a neutral girl and what I'm doing, I'm gonna take a clean brush and I'm just going to blend. But I am a, I'm definitely a neutral girl. This color right here is even me venturing out but I love when I do this because it gives you the most prettiest look that you might not have ever discovered if you didn't just try it. Yeah, because I'm already loving it and I love makeup looks like this. Okay, and you know, this is all we're going to do right now for the eyeshadow. I'll let you look up close. Next, I'm going to go in with one of my favorite foundations. This is the L'Oreal True Match Nude Hyaluronic Tinted Serum. And I have the shade 10.511. And this is what the bottle looks like right here. I'm just going to take that and dab it all around my face. I love this foundation because it's so skin-like. Taking my flat foundation brush, and I'm just going to go ahead and smooth that in. Then I'm going to go back into my concealer, that e.l.f. hydrating concealer right here that we use to prime my lids. And we're just going to highlight underneath my eye. I just use two dots. You don't need a lot of concealer every time. 
really it all just depends on what look you're going for. And I'm just going to highlight all the areas that I want brightened. So just a little bit over my lip. I put some over my smile lines. My chin. A little bit on my nose, not too much. And then a little on my forehead. This spreads out really good, so you don't need a whole bunch. And guys, if you're wondering why my hair is like this, this is how I curl my hair. So you guys will see at the end, I'm going to take it out and you'll see that it comes out super cute. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my Juvia's Place bronzer, deep dark, and we're just going to bronze. We're going to bronze. I like to use this top shade, this one right here. And I just bronze right here along my cheekbone and I kind of carry it up like that. My forehead and then I go in with another brush like this and I just bronze my nose slightly contouring with that same color that I used I'm going to be using one of my favorite setting powders. You guys already know, Huda Beauty. But today we're going to be using the color Kanafa. This is what the packaging looks like. This is the color. It's a yellow powder. I've been using my lighter powder so much, but I said, you know what? This is a nice warm color. I'm going to use that. So I'm just tapping it in here and then kind of like tapping it off my hand so it's not too much. And we're just going to press it in underneath our eyes. Then I go over the other areas that I want to be brightened and the areas that I just want to set. So normally around my smile lines, my chin where I put that concealer. You want to set everywhere you put concealer. So a little bit on our forehead, tiny bit on the bridge of our nose, and The lid was on. Thought it was over. You guys know makeup is not cheap. <laughs> okay, we're back. I'm just gonna pat that nose powder in. All right, so I'm gonna go back into this palette right here. We're going to use that same color we used on our eyes. This color right here, Jamila or Jamila. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to put that underneath my eye. I want to bring a little bit of that orange underneath. I think that's going to be really pretty. Just sweeping that underneath my eye. And because I want it to be a little bit more obvious, I'm going to go into Cicado. That was that second color we put that just added depth on our eyes. We're going to use that and just sweep that underneath the outer corner. Just to make it pop, you know? Pretty. All right, and then we're gonna go in with our, you guys already know, Essence Lash Mascara. I use this all the time. And I'm just going to put on a little bit of mascara. Now, I'm not using a whole lot because I am gonna wear falsies today, which is very rare for me these days because I always have on lash extensions. You know, the do-it-yourself lash extensions I always do those now like this entire year I've just wore lash extensions I love them but because I don't have them on right now we're going to use the mascara and strip lash now I'm going to go in with my wet and wild precious petals and 
this is just one of my favorite parts of makeup, the highlight. So I put it on the center part of my nose like so, and then I take just a tiny bit. I go down my nose. I realize I use the same brush as my eyeshadow. I'm so glad it didn't show. But let's get a new brush. It's life, life in makeup. Okay, now we're gonna take it and just put it on the tops of our cheekbones. I just love this highlighter. I don't even know how I discovered it. I think I just picked it up because it looked pretty and I was searching for another highlighter and I have used it the entire year. I have not hardly used anything else. It's so good and it's so affordable. All right guys, and we are almost finished. What I'm going to do now is spray my face and I'm just going to be using the NYX Matte Finish and this is up to 16 hour wear. It looks like a bottle like this. And we're just going to spray our face. <sighs> that feels so good. And you can see how the colors are just coming together. And now for the lips. What do you think, a dark lip? I'm definitely thinking dark, it's fall. So, okay, let me show you. Let me slow down, I'm getting excited. We're gonna use the Juvia's Place Lux Liner in the color Coco Latte. It is a really, really, really deep lip liner. I don't use it normally, but since we're going in for the dark lip, we're gonna use it. And I'm just going to line my lips. You guys see how dark that is? It's almost black, I would say. Then we're gonna go in with this pretty color that I feel like screams fall, and it is by NYX LXXL09. It's this pretty like plum maroon color. And we're just gonna apply that in the middle of our lips. Ooh, that's so pretty and dark, I love it. And the last thing that we're going to apply are these lashes right here. Thank you to KISS for sending me these over in PR. These are from their Muse collection, handmade with refined faux silk. And I'm so excited. This one is called Duchess. I'm going to do these off camera because it takes me a while to put on my strip lashes. And you don't wanna watch me do that. So, or maybe you do, we'll do a video on another day. But. I'll be back with these lashes on. All right, you guys, I am back and this is the finished look. I'm loving the results. The lashes are really, really pretty. They just add like extra glam. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified when I do more videos. I love you, Jesus loves you, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.